Hello guys, welcome to Viva Barca, welcome to the home of every Barcelona lover, welcome to the home of everything Barcelona. Guys, in this interesting episode, we are going to be discussing on some recent developments from the Barcelona camp. Starting with, of course, we know Ronald Koeman's future have been in serious doubt after that disastrous 3-3 draw away at Levante that blew away our La Liga hopes. Um, as per reports, late Joran Cruyff's son, Jody Cruyff, has been recently linked with Barcelona um and as per reports if ronald coleman is sacked as i said if coleman is sacked eventually joey jody croft will be the next manager of barcelona we're going to be discussing much details about that secondly we're going to be discussing about sergio aguero we all know sergio aguero have been linked with barcelona for the past couple of months and as per reports Aguero have been eager and eager to come to Barcelona as time goes on. And guys, lastly, we are going to be discussing about Sergi Roberto. After that disastrous performance I've ever seen from him yesterday that contributed to our downfall in that 3 3 game against Levante. Guys, the sad news again is his injury. He has another injury again, the same injury he had that sustained him for over four months. Sergi Roberto has been out again with injury just after that game. So, guys, Prepare yourself as we are going to be discussing in much details this interesting newscast today. I hope you enjoy the episode. So please, please, if you haven't clicked on that subscribe button, if you're a Barcelona lover, please don't hesitate to do so because here on Viva Barca, we are all Barcelona lovers and you should be part of the team. In what can only be described as a bombshell, reports claiming in from sources like journalist Veronica Brodnati suggest that Jody Cruyff is now the primary candidate to take over as head coach of Barcelona if Ronald Koeman is replaced. As is so often the case after a strange you note know, of disappointing result, the fans and media alike have immediately climbed onto Ronald Koeman's back with wide speculation regarding his departure from the manager position. The 3 3 draw against Levante is no exception, as Barcelona squandered yet another opportunity to go top of La Liga table, with plenty of names constantly floating around the Barcelona sphere to take over the club's helm. Judy Cruyff is undoubtedly a left field shout. Why he has you now constantly been linked to Barcelona with a job in the technical department, it has never been that of a manager. The legendary Johan Cruyff's son has also reiterated his desire to join Barcelona under Juan Laporta's presidency. There have been obstacles with negotiations due to his prior commitments to Chinese outfit Shenzhen FC, but there is plenty to suggest that Jody Cruyff will come to Barcelona once he honors his contract with them. Brunati also suggests that given the gravity of the economic crisis and other organizational problems that plague the club, Judy Cruyff is the likeliest candidate. There is also no money for large signings. Pep Guardiola leaving Manchester City is unlikely and Javi's renewal with Assad is all but sealed. With doubt continually brewing over Coman's future, perhaps Barcelona is indeed planning for next season without him at the helm but with another Dutchman in his place. Sergio Aguero wants to join Barcelona like crazy this summer when his contract in Manchester City expires. That is according to Mundo Deportivo who claims the Blues all-time top goal scorer is desperate to join the La Liga Giants, eager to play alongside close friend, fellow countryman and six-time Ballon d'Or winner Lionel Messi at the Camp Nou. Recent reports suggested that Aguero had already agreed on a deal with Barcelona, but fresh details claim Barcelona boss Ronald Koeman prefers Lyon's Memphis Depay and will seek to sign the Dutchman over Aguero if he remains in charge of the club next season. The article also suggests any deal for Aguero would be more likely if Messi commits to a new contract at Barcelona though. Barcelona confirmed on Wednesday that Sergio Roberto has been silent yet again with another injury picked up in that disastrous 3-3 draw against Levante. Roberto came on at halftime for Ronald Araujo and then had to suffer the ignominy of being replaced late on it in the game. It was a night to forget for the 29-year-old who put in a very poor performance and may not now feature again for the club in this season. However, FC Barcelona wrote on its website, the first team player Sergio Roberto has a thigh problem in his right leg. He is unavailable for selection and his recovery will dictate when he can return. 
The Barca number 20 came on at half time to replace Ronald Araujo but had to be replaced himself on 85 minutes by Ricky Pitch. In total, he played 40 minutes of the 3 3 draw against Levante in the Codia de Valencia Stadium. So, guys, as we all know, Sergio Roberto has already missed large chunks of the season through injury and his future at the club is a little uncertain. The midfielder is out of contract next season so could be sold if an offer arrives at the end of the season. So, guys, that's all for this episode and I hope you did enjoy the video. Thanks a lot for watching and please if you haven't clicked on that subscribe button please endeavor to do so to always stay up to date with everything Barcelona until then bye bye